Hey, it's the Corked Cowgirl here. It has been a long time since we've done a video wine review. I figured tonight was the night. Um, it's, it's been a long day between work, I've got uh, lying nine-year-olds, I've got teenage daughters with attitude, mommy needs her sippy cup of wine. So tonight, we are going ahead and coming out to the personal oasis here, the back deck, in my jammies, no less. My neighbors probably hate me. Don't really care. So, and we are reviewing the, here, let's see if we can get a, a good shot of it, Caligiori, uh, the 2009 Bernarda out of Mendoza, Argentina. Now, the, the fun thing about, and I hope I'm pronouncing this right, Christopher Cribb, if I am pronouncing it wrong, please, please, please get a hold of me and chastise me thoroughly. But um, anyway, uh, they are, uh, the global headquarters are based here in Kansas City. And I wanted to go ahead and try these wines because they're big into the whole organic deal. And that's kind of the, the, the neat thing, you know, organic, sustainable uh, uh, wines. I wanted to go ahead and try it. So we've got it pulled out. I didn't know much about Bernarda other than the Italians brought it over to Argentina. And it, it works well. So I went ahead and poured this. And uh, it is uh, very, very, very dark, as you can tell. Almost as dark as the night here. It has, uh, we'll go ahead. It's been a long day. And I just snorted it. <laughs> I just snorted it. Don't do that when you are trying to uh, get the bouquet. Before it went straight up my nose, um, well, actually, that might have helped the whole the whole scent thing. You've got uh, dark berries on it. You've got kind of an earthy, spicy. Oh, yeah, definitely have the spicy. Holy buckets! I don't think that was meant to happen. But it's nice, and, and I'm getting kind of a, a mocha scent on it as well. I think the best way to do is uh, to just go ahead and taste it here and make sure we know what the flavor palette is. God, that's good. That is so good. After uh, the faux pas of actually snorting the wine. Don't, don't do that. That's not how you're supposed to go ahead and get the bouquet. But as far as the flavor is concerned, Definite blueberries, maybe a little bit of cherry. See, I did better this time. I didn't. I didn't snort anything. Blueberry cherry. You get um, good tannins on it. Kind of an earthy feel to it. One more sip. You always have to be sure. Yeah, I'm slurping. It's not, it's not very uh, pretty, but it does help in getting the taste. There's milk chocolate in that. There is milk chocolate. It's got a nice finish, kind of a smooth, silky finish. Like I said, it's got some salad tannins. Don't expect it to be like it normally... I spilled on myself, didn't I? Don't expect it to be like a normal Argentinian, like a Malbec or anything like that. You're not going to have those, you know, hard, chewy tannins. This is nice. This has got sort of a, a smooth finish to it, and um, almost silky. Uh, it, it's it's got a lot of complexity, a lot of structure, but it's not you know chewy and and uh, biting and and what have you. This is a great one. I could see pairing this um, if I was going to go ahead and throw a pork tenderloin on the grill, or if I was going to do. Um, if I was going to do lamb, if I was going to go ahead and throw um, lamb on and, and do something like that, maybe even some venison. Tonight I am going all redneck. I, I don't have lamb and I don't have pork. I have, um, gosh, I'm such a redneck. I've got my beef stick and that's what I'm going to be pairing it up with and, and maybe um, some uh, blue cheese crumbles. That's what I'm going with. But... If you wanted to pair it up properly, I would go ahead and put it with with lamb 
or with uh, pork tenderloin, like I said, on the grill. Because this is this is really a hot wine. Caligiore 2009 Bonarda from Mendoza, Argentina. It is organic. It is organic because they care about about the earth and everything else. So uh, check it out. Find it. Give it a try for yourself. I think you'll enjoy it. Uh, me, I'm going to enjoy a lot of it right now, and I'm going to get the... Um, the wine out of my nose here. It is corked cowgirl saying, you know, I just need to have a little vacation and enjoy some more wine, as should you. So on that note, salute.